Babe, what are we doing right now? We're going to get a van. What's wrong with us? I don't know. This how, is very impulsive. How far are we driving? Over five hours. One way. Oh, yeah. One we way. got our coffee. We got up early for us. And we're headed to Kentucky. Yeehaw. We are driving, and I'm pretty sure we are in the middle of nowhere. We've got to talk to this guy. We've driven... Four and a half hours. Four and a half hours. And uh, we still have no clue if he's going to be there or if we may get murdered. I don't know. We've called him four times to go straight to voicemail, too. This but one. we're really excited to get this van if he's here. So We are. We've been planning and dreaming this whole ride. This is time to overlook. So to make a long story short, we made it bought the van, got it home, and the new adventure begins from there. She's in her first snow with us. So currently trying to fill out title and registration. It's a little complicated because the DMV is closed. We bought our vehicle from a guy who got it from a church. So we're just gonna keep you guys posted in case anyone else is doing the same thing. We'll let you know what we are going through. So we're filling it all out online and we're gonna see what happens. As we're filling out this paperwork, we realized the guy never signed over the vehicle into his name, and it had been over 90 days, so we decided to take it to someone. So the last clip you saw us trying to put in our own information to get our title and registration, it was a huge fail. We called everyone, no one could help. So I did a little search and found a lady, and we drove about an hour, right? Yeah. About an hour, we found a lady for a small fee that did our title registration for us for, I don't know, it took... Ten minutes? Maybe ten minutes. So now we are official van owners. We're just doing... It's camper van. <gasps> What, what am I doing? What's so funny? <laughs> Why are you laughing? I'm sorry. So we're researching camper van builds because we honestly have no idea what we are doing. And we found an article. And I want to read it. With you. You can read it with me as well. So I don't know if you can hear me, the van's a little loud, but we are inside of it and headed to the car dealership place to get the van checked out, get an oil change. It hasn't had an oil change in like four years and we will see how that goes and keep you posted. We forgot to tell you guys after the oil change how that went. They did not inspect it like we thought that they would, but she's got a clear bill of health for the most part. And oil change went well. Now we've been driving her for a day and a half just around town, try and see how it's doing. So buying our van has been a bit of a journey, but now that she's titled, has a temporary license plate, and she's running good, it's time to show you a van tour, so stay tuned next time to see the inside of our 2000 Dodge Ram Wagon 3500. See you then!